You know, he's a wild outlaw. He can't, we can't recognize him in Nashville. Wild Terry Frank to get drunk. Saying I'm my father's son and I'm not perfect and... You know what? If you don't like it, then go to hell. Once he broke out of that shell, I mean, there was no turning back for him. Finally, even the establishment had to agree that this was a superstar. Wicked women and We're got it all in here. He just did it once again by being completely himself and not really caring what people thought. You gotta respect that in a man that can go out there and do that. It didn't take you long to learn to do the guitar. Look here. I don't know if I've ever met anybody cockier. I don't know if I've met anybody more confident. He's got it going on. One of the best entertainers I've ever seen in my life. Running up and around the stage and just getting wild as hell, man. And I mean, it was like, yeah! Here's a guy who most rock stars should take lessons from. If you want to know how to raise hell, just start listening to Hank Jr. albums. Hey! The album that turned Nashville upside down. 76 with the very first platinum album in country music history. Wanted. The Outlaw. Suddenly the entire universe shifted on its axis. And the Outlaw movement got respect. <laughs>